Absolutely. All right. The forecast is going to have some clearing, going to have some rain. Sorry, Sean. Yep. Looks like it is going to be the case if you're going to be picking up the kids here in a little while, about uh, two hours, maybe three hours, depending on elementary, middle school, or high school. Looks like you're going to probably see a little bit of cloud cover, a little bit of sunshine, maybe a few sprinkles, but the better chance for rain is going to be later this evening as the front moves in. That is going to cool us down for the weekend, get us back to more seasonal temps. Outside right now, looking out at Lake Travis from the Steiner Ranch Steakhouse, live webcam there showing, well, uh, really just kind of scattered clouds. We do get a little sunshine here and there. It has been lighting up in some places, in other areas, not not so much. Otherwise, it is going to be just a kind of a quiet afternoon. We'll watch for the shower possibilities. Looking out at Profiler right now, you can see that we do have a little front to the northwest of us. Slow to move in. It'll take uh, a while to get here. It's kind of gathering up its uh, uh, energy as it pushes through. We'll see a possibility for showers and thunder showers as a result of that. Notice the wind directions out of the south, southwest, and southwest to the just below that. And then you see one northwest up in Brownwood, and then everybody else north of that is looking at uh, winds out of the northwest. It will gust up. Probably by the time you go to sleep, this will all be heading out of here. Real quick check of Viper, and you can see where the showers are lining up just to the east of Abilene and San Angelo. Give it a little time. We do expect showers and thunder showers to roll in, and beyond that, well, it'll cool down and clear up by tomorrow morning, making for a, a nice day. 76 degrees, cloud cover. Again, mostly cloudy, not really looking at uh, a lot of sunshine, but occasionally you do see it. We don't see a whole lot of shower activity locally right now. We have seen it earlier. Winds out of the south, southwest at 16 miles per hour. Humidity at 71%. Dew point 66, pressure 30.10 and falling right now. It has been falling past hour. Nothing as far as advisories across the area. We have temperatures this morning that reached the low 60s, like 61 in Lano. Some 63s and 64s out into areas of the hill country. You get a little further in town along I-35, the I-35. 35 corridor and down 183. You get mid-60s and upper 60s out to the east, generally upper 60s, 68s and 69s. Right now, we're in the 70s all the way to 82 in LaGrange, 78 at the airport, 76 here in Austin, 75 in Georgetown. If you live in San Marcos or driving that way, it's a little warmer there at 81 degrees. Rockdale at 75, 74, 75s, and then 79 in Lionel at the moment. Temperatures vary. All right. We have a front to the west of us, northwest of us, stretching out across parts of west Texas. You see the front and the area of low pressure that it's centered off of. The uh, comma-shaped storm has showers in it. Don't really have anything severe out of it. Did have a couple or a few, maybe, thunderstorm warnings up in Oklahoma. Maybe that'll build up this afternoon. We might see more of that. But it's good that we haven't had that so far. The storm is not as potent, if you will, and it's a thin line of showers. Now, there has been some lightning along this and more of it to the north. Our forecast models, I think, did a good job of picking up on this this morning. Three through noontime in that little line that I just showed you stretching out uh, east of Abilene and San Angelo, that's depicted here quite well. In fact, you can see we have a little scattered shower activity passing through here on our forecast model. That too. Not always, uh, not everywhere are we seeing showers, but I think the general trend is for it to be in these areas. Into the afternoon. Say uh, by 5.30, everybody on the roads might have some showers and thunder showers. That continues and pushes to the east by tomorrow morning. Maybe some lingering sprinkles. You sometimes get a secondary line of showers built up. You might see that on the radar if you're watching. You can check that out at KXAN.com. Beyond that, well, you'll have some sunshine tomorrow, but it clouds up again into Sunday. 80 for the high today. Cloud cover, showers off and on. Maybe some thunderstorms this evening. Cooling down, though, towards the morning hours as the cool air moves in. Winds out of the north. Seven-day forecast has the temperatures only up to 68 tomorrow with some scattered clouds and sun. Sunshine. So nice tomorrow, best day to be out tomorrow. And then a little colder, a little wetter. Chance for rain on top of the temperatures in the 50s, 40s to 50s, 40s to 60s with rain on Monday. After that, sunshine, highs back in the 70s. No freezing temps, but 40s through the end of next week. More